kids. Sorry about that. Um, I had a meeting. And so this is module three. Sorry for cutting you off. Lesson 14, number four only. Quick video just to solve number four. So here it is. Volunteers helped clean up eight and two tenths kilograms of trash in one neighborhood and 11 and a half kilograms in another. Now out of all this trash, they sent one and one fourth kilograms to be recycled and then threw the rest away, which kind of common because a lot of stuff isn't recyclable. So how many kilograms of trash did they throw away? So for this, we've got a couple of different neighborhoods, N1 and N2, neighborhood one and two. We have eight and two tenths. Let's just take all of these decimal numbers and weird things and make them compatible. If I have 11 and a half, I would like that to also be tenths. So take your 11 and a half and instead of putting 11 and a half, I know I need tenths, so I'm going to make it 11 and 5 tenths right away. Okay, and so take your um, numbers, your mixed numbers, and you want to make them have common denominators right from the get-go. So we're going to combine these two. It's pretty straightforward. Again, strategize, use your mental math. 8 plus 11, that's going to be 19. 5 plus 2, that's going to be 7. So it's a really easy addition problem here. They're not really stressing us out with anything too difficult. But what do we do with this trash now? That is going to take our 19 and 7 tenths kilograms of trash, and we're going to have some go to the recyclers and some go just for trash. And so they tell you that we've got 1 and 1 fourth, kilograms that go to be recycled and mystery number when we throw it away. Now with this, if this was combined to get the whole, we can't just combine because we don't have this number, but what you do here is you can take your 19 and 7 tenths, take away what you do know, which is 1 and 1 fourth, and, um, and then find out the amount of trash, uh, the the stuff that was collected that has to just be thrown in the trash and cannot be recycled. So 19 minus 1 is 18. Don't worry about the 7 tenths right now. I need to take away the 1 fourth. You can also do 19 minus 1 and 1 fourth if that's how you would like to do it um, instead. So it's really up to you. You don't have to use this method. Remember there are several methods for subtraction. But what I do need is a common denominator. So I have 18 and 7 tenths, which I would like to be 20ths. I want 20ths to be my common denominator. Again, if you forgot how to do that, line them up, skip count, use the big number. When you see that this is a multiple of the other number, use the scale factor for that number. Scale factor for 4, if I have 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, the scale factor is going to be 5 for 4 and 2 for 10. So to get from 10 to 20, that's a scale factor of 2. 2 times 7 is 14. If I have <coughs> um, a scale factor of 5 for 4, 4 times 5. And uh, taking your uh, 14 minus 5, and you get your 9, 18, and 9 20th kilograms is the difference between... Uh, the 19 and 7 tenths and 1 and 1 fourth. And so that is the amount of trash. It became trash. Okay. And so I hope this is helpful. So sorry I couldn't get it on the previous video. Uh, click subscribe and come back again. And we'll see you on another one. Ciao for now. Bye.